fourth generation of Fateh 110 surface-to-surface -surface missile has been successfully tested. In a press conference in Tehran, Iran's Defense Minister Brigadier General Ahmad Vahidi explained that Iran's Islamic Revolution Guards Corps, the IRGC, along with the Aerospace Force, have successfully tested the fourth generation of Fateh surface-to-surface -surface missile, which has a range of 300 kilometers. Iran's Defense Minister explained that although previous generation of Fateh missiles were built to have extreme power and speed, the fourth generation of the missile has been fine-tuned to have great precision with target accuracy. Brigadier General Vahidi also explained Iran's defense capabilities against recent threats, especially ones brought by Israel. The best way to respond, I think, is just like the high-ranking military official of the Zionist regime was asked, what would happen if Israel attacks Iran? And he said Iran would retaliate and wreak havoc. That is unimaginable. Iran's defense minister also stated the most important feature of the latest Fateh missile is its capability to strike any target on surface and sea within a range of 300 kilometers of the Persian Gulf and the Sea of Oman. It has the capability to hit all targets with great accuracy within 300 kilometers of the Sea of Oman and the Persian Gulf. Referring to the ongoing violence in Syria, Brigadier General Vahidi also said, Countries that are supplying terrorists with weapons in Syria are causing unrest in the country and the region. These countries will eventually be questioned and pay the consequences. Today the people in Syria are not causing unrest. It's the terrorists that have entered from different countries. Iran's defense military will soon put the fourth generation of Fateh 110 or Conqueror missile into mass production. Brigadier General Vahidi reiterated that Iran's defense missiles will be used for the sole purpose of protecting and defending the Islamic Republic of Iran and its people against any harm brought by its enemies. In addition, Iran's defense minister explained that Iran is ranked only amongst few countries that have the capabilities of producing such missiles. Amir Hussein Eskanda, Press TV, Tehran.